European Union need to share that burden, just as in the United States we grapple with these issues as well. Um, I will also say, you know, so impressed by by Amadou and, and your marathon well, runner, yes. you know, demonstrating how these experiences with groups like Metadrasi can help people to launch themselves and become contributing members to the society. Um, and, and I think that's the hope that we all have. Um, for the kids, school is obviously critically important. I've discussed this with Minister Keremias. I know that she shares, as a mother, as a minister, she shares the commitment to the idea that children should be in school, that they should have the opportunity for education. So, thank you. And Sing on, on the issue of the school, yeah. I want to tell you, Mr. Ambassador, that since uh, there are a lot of problems in the public schools, because yeah. some children are coming in Greece knowing no language, yeah. so we are going to start the program with the UNICEF uh, three-year program. Uh, so we are going to have formal, uh, a non-formal education and the bridge to formal education, so children can go more normally to the public Greek school, which is difficult e even for us. And uh, this is, you know, it will be for three years and we try to have all children going to the, the public school, which is uh, uh, mandatory in Greece. I mean, the first thing they, they know when they arrive is that in Greece school is mandatory. So, Ms. Wilderty, uh, please tell us, what is your impression on the visit to Tony? Well, look, it's wonderful. Yeah. I think well, I, I know the problem. Yeah. Brian will, will explain yeah. to Mr. Ambassador what's the problem. The problem, let's say, is that they have here a mixed population. So, since the European Union gives money for, for the refugee children, then when the population are mixed, there is a problem. But uh, and we are I'll, I'll do my best, yeah. yes, I'll do my best to, to yeah. find the solution. So the children must not go to the camps back, since they are here. I mean, it will be something going back. It's not good. And I'll do my best on this. Uh, you know that we had the law uh, in order not to have children in the police station, which uh, when we arrived at the government, we had more than 300 children at the police station. And we had more than 5,000 unaccompanied children. Now we, are, we have what, about 2,000 children. Yesterday we had uh, an important relocation.